Hello everyone, it's me again, GW Fan the Softcore Brony, welcoming back to Let's Play Mother 3. Uh, since last time I sold some items that I don't need, uh, you know, the weapons and armor that I picked up, I have kept the, where is it, the Boing ribbon though, because it prevents forgetfulness. Not that I really think it's going to be that useful, since there's only three enemies left in the game that even can even inflict this, not counting the Monkleris. And one of those enemies is totally uh, inconsequential, and the other two are bosses I'm not especially uh, concerned about, but, you know, just in case, you might want it. So, otherwise, I am right here, kind of in the middle of the uh, forest or jungle or... I guess it's a jungle, because, just to point out this spot right here, because if you're looking for the mystical gloves, like I have, this is a spot right in between Monklerises, so you can just keep on respawning the guy right here, and, uh, you know, eventually you'll probably be able to get a hold of the mystical gloves, you know, if you're looking for them, so, you know, it's, it's also a good f spot for level grinding if you wanted to get to level 45 before, uh, you know, fighting the Barrio Trio, which I already did last time. Uh, otherwise, since getting to at level 43, uh, I also uh, Lucas also learned Life of Gamma, which fully restores one character's HP for not very uh, expensive either. So pretty good there. Uh, Kumatora will never learn that spell, by the way. Uh, but anyway, I'm going to make my way back to the beach, and I'll meet you there. So. Seriously? The first one I ran into. Seriously? You're trolling me now, game. Good grief. <laughs> oh my gosh. This game, man. This game. Ah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, I'll... I'll meet you there. <laughs> You know what? I take it back. The game is trolling you guys, not me, because I already have one. But anyway, we're back here at the start where the energizing mushrooms are now gone. And also that mushroom is permanently gone as well. Uh, oh, hey, look you. Yeah, you are. What happened to the snake? Oh, really? Okay. I see. Uh, no, I'm good. Thanks. Anyway, yeah, that uh, was resolved, so... Oh, and I'm feeling feverish now. Well, Kumatora is. Anyway, Ocho's here in the water. Uh, what level did... I think she got the level 43? Yeah, so... Yeah, she's gonna learn, uh, Fire Gamma. <laughs> which, uh, does between 190 and 250 points of damage there, so... Yep. So we don't have to walk back across the ocean floor, fortunately. Uh, okay. Taxi. Wow, who knew? <laughs> Poor pony. Okay. We do get to see the ocean floor, though, for some reason. Apparently, oxygen doesn't matter right now. Oh, they are kind of sentient. Wow, that's... weird. Hey, guys. Good work today. We won't be needing air from you anytime soon, but, uh, good work anyway. Okay. You know, I have no idea if we can use him again if we go back there. Oh, wow, you look sunburnt, dude! In the worst possible places, too. Well, at least one place, anyway. Uh. Sure, I'll heal myself, why not? I could use it. different? Nope. Still dreaming about Oscar and Meyer, huh? 
Hey, the music's a little different now. Hey, the guy who was selling Aloha coats is gone. What the heck? Hey, Rope Snake, you still there? Hey. Oh, there's Fiat Fire Gamma. Very good. Oh, yeah, yeah, you've already said all this. Blah, 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 blah. We know, we know. You're not a worm, you're the snake, but blah, 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 blah. You're gonna be a behemoth someday, and yeah, 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 yeah. Anyway, I can run now, so where'd they go? Oh, hey, Wes. The big city? Yeah. Oh, no? Yeah, I do. Oh, all the way up there? Wow. Oh, yeah, I guess I could... Yeah, he's still around. Not that we really need it, but, uh, yeah! It's... Most of the people in Tasmanian Village are kind of, like, gone-ish now. Hey, Mapson. I do, finally. I mean, not really, but... Alright, it's been marked. Fine now. Yep. Yeah, so Ionia's house is way up there. So it's pretty easy to get to. We just walk through the forest. But yeah, a lot of residents are gone now. Oh, pff, really? Uh, I don't know. Yeah, most of the businesses are closed. Oh, you're still here. Oh, yeah? I should just ditch this miserable little village. <laughs> well, screw you too, man. Screw you too. Oh. No, no, not a thing. Oh. You're driving real slow. No. Yeah, he's still... Well, his family's still here, but... I don't know. I mean, it's not like you were making a profit off of it originally. I think... Yeah, you're still here. Already? Oh, yeah? Yeah, he still has the same stuff he did at the beginning of the game, so mostly useless stuff. I think the Yeddo... Is the Yeddo Inn open? Yeah, this is still open, but not that I really need it. But anyway... Uh, basically, at this point, we're just going to head up and through the forest. And uh, I'll meet you, I guess, at the new area, <laughs> if you will. So. Oh, yeah. And if you need any further directions, the arrow lizards will also direct you to where you need to go. And, well, obviously, the enemies we're in here are nonsense now, so we can just easily just wipe them out like that. Are you home? Oh, no. Oh, yeah, everyone's gone to the big city, and there's healing over there. Not that I need it, so... Again, I'll meet you up where... Well, where we need to go, so... The game really is trolling me. Look at that! Even the Black Beanling's here! Oh, God! Dang it! Oh, well. Well, actually, I guess I could fight you now. I mean... It's not like... You know, you're really gonna make much of a difference. And plus, you're really easy at this point as well. Oh, he's still really fast. Ow, 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 ow. Ha! Now we can just totally kick him in the butt, too. Well, I guess I got him in my, uh... Inventory, or whatever you call it, but yeah. Yeah, Lucas didn't even get a level up out of that. Oh, actually... Those was pretty close now. Anyway, yeah, I'll meet you there still. Ha! Yeah, I'm a monster. Oh, I should, I, I should get you for the thing too, huh? But you're dead, so never mind. Stupid Slytherin! Oh, there we go. Yeah, Kumatro recognizes this area. North of here, eh? Ah. Alright, yeah, I'm up here now, so... Easy enough to get to. Don't take the, uh, yeah, the path over there <laughs> to the, uh, west that's, like, kind of, you know, right over there, though, so. And climb the ladder. So, yeah, these guys, you can even knock out of the way now, which is kind of fun. 
Argila Path. Originally, there was ants uh, preventing us from getting this way before. Oh, yeah? Well, too bad. Stumble Pass, huh? Okay, yeah, yeah, okay, whatever. Anyway, oh! Oh. Yeah, that was kind of weird. Huh, what? Are you serious? We dropped that? We must have. Oh, yeah, I guess it is kind of round, isn't it? No kidding. Alright. Yeah, Boney, you help too. In fact, you be the only one to really look. Because now... Come on. We take control of Boney! And, uh, we get to, well, talk to everyone. Except for Lucas, I guess, in a way, but... And you'll see shiny things everywhere. I like the music that plays. Actually, you're standing the closest to it. It's not that one. But yeah, you're standing the closest to it, I think. But anyway, there's, yeah, all these shiny things. And you will want to save state, if you will, before, if you want to, before uh, getting these. Because each of these will be typically one of three items. One of them is one, I think this is the one that's one of four items. But, uh, and depending on which, uh, well, each one is uh, has a certain amount of rarity as to what it might be. This one something hard. This could be one of three things that I do not care about. In fact, only one of these is something I even care about. Uh, this could be a mage you look most of the time. It could, uh, sometimes it might be an enemy bufferizer, and on rare occasions it might be a super bomb. I have tried really hard to get the rare stuff, and oh my gosh, I cannot get them. I will, I would not bother trying to get the rare stuff. Yeah, sure, why not? I don't care. This one... This should be a... something tasty, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, this one will be one of four things. Nut bread, rotten eclair, uh, peculiar cheese, or an item called the king burger, which I guess would be useful, but... Yeah, whatever. Yeah, I don't care about any of those either. Let's see, this one... Something soft, fresh mint, Recollection Bell, or Secret Herb. Again, I don't really care. Fresh Mint. I got the easiest, or the most likely of all of them. Jeez. So then there's this one. This is the only one I really care about. This is the one I do want to save state for. Because... Something small. This could be one of three very useful things. The Pumice Charm, which is, well... Uh, body armor that we're going to be able to buy shortly anyway, so I don't really care. The heavy charm, which is, which will basically serve as the ultimate armor for both Lucas and uh, Duster, you know, generally, even though it really isn't. Uh, it's just the easiest to come by. The rare item is the thud charm. Oh, good, I got the heavy charm right away. Yeah, it's the thud charm. I've never been able to get it. It is, this, as far as I'm aware, is the only way to get it. It is, it ha is the highest defensive body armor in the game at, uh, well, 30. It's only four points stronger than the heavy charm. It is the best armor in the game for Duster and can serve as the ultimate armor for Lucas. Although there is something better, even if it's not defensively better. But yeah, I'm glad I got the, the heavy charm which I'll give to Lucas uh, eventually. But this right here is what we're looking for. This will always be the same thing. Something that seems sour, because this is the yummy pickles, no matter what. I like this music. I think I already said that, but... Hey! I did find it! Yummy! Alright, do you have... Who has the... It must be Boney. Yeah, let's give that to Lucas for now, I think. Do you want? Yeah, let's give it to Lucas for now. The other stuff I don't care about, but... Eventually, I'll end up giving it to, uh, Duster. Well, I'll, no, actually, I'll end up buying... ...something better for anyway, but... Yeah, I guess I don't need that other one for now. Well, actually... Well, no, we're gonna be getting something better for Kumatora in the near future anyway, so... I guess I could give it to her, but... Yeah, whatever. Anyway, moving on, we got the hot springs, which always has an extra syllable, so if you need it, 
Dang, it's a long ways. And we also have a safe frog if we need it. How much money do I have right now, anyway? Lots? I see. Not that I'm gonna really need all that, but, uh, yeah, there you go. And there's also a mole cricket! Ah, I see. <laughs> you found lying on the... I mean, stuck up on! <laughs> sure, sure. You do have some pretty good stuff. You still have the sincerity of nothings. He has the clever stick, which is much stronger than that stick we just picked up! Good grief. Alright, get rid of that old vigor stick, even though it actually looks like it's... Kind of looks like a cactus, doesn't it? On a stick. <laughs> Got these strong gloves, which obviously isn't as defensive... Er, yeah, offensive as the, uh, the mystical gloves. Ag again, I would debate getting it. It's barely stronger than that spi uh, spiky weapon, whatever it was called. And debatably better than the magical gloves if you're still using those. You got the non-slip shoes. This is where it gets debatable whether or not you want to keep the mystical shoes or not. Because this is 18 points stronger, which is does make a pretty big difference in this game. I'm going to actually think about this, because I do like... I, I, I'm the type of player that prefers offense and speed over, like... And I guess, you know, a more defensive... Uh, playing or whatever, because even though the HP and speed boost of the mystical shoes is still useful, but yeah, I'll think about it. We also got the otter hat, which is defensively stronger, but I do not want it for Lucas, because, you know, he's got the awesome crown, so something better for Boney there. Oh, who's really lacking on item space? The crow bandana for Duster, which already replaces the other item that we just barely got for him, and I didn't even really need. And then we have the Pumice Charm, which, you know, we could have just got there, so... Yeah, let's go ahead and buy that for Kumatora, because it is quite a bit more defensive. Uh... I don't think I'm gonna need this, but I'll go ahead and keep it anyway. And yeah, let's get one of those for you as well. Uh, whatever. You know what? I'm probably not gonna need it. Grilled Fish, pretty good for the price, I guess. Actually, that, this one right here is very good for the price. And then we have some other items that we might need. So, uh, that's all good. I can heal if I need it. With, well, actually, I guess I did take a little bit of damage on the way. Uh, finding the Black Binning and all. And we'll continue up the Argila Pass next time on Let's Play Mother 3. Arrivederci!